The pandemic has kept our gourmet group out of the restaurants these days. But in my kitchen, there's been a lot of experimenting going on. Welcome to Loretto's Kitchen. That, plus the fact that I planted a garden last spring, and one of the items that I planted was kale. This led me to check out the internet for potential kale recipes. I discovered this chicken kale and sweet potato skillet on MelsKitchenCafe.com. As it turned out, it was very easy to make, tasted delicious. It made enough for more than one meal, and in addition, the leftovers are even tastier than the original meal. So, I wanted to share this with you. All that you need is olive oil, okay. a pound of boneless skinless chicken breasts, a red onion, red bell pepper, garlic, and two medium sweet potatoes, chicken broth, kale, and Monterey Jack cheese, salt and pepper, and red pepper flakes. First, I'll cube the chicken breast in half inch pieces, then I'll be seasoning it with salt and pepper. I'm going to dice the onion. I'm using a half a onion. Seed, stem, and dice the red bell pepper. I have a yam because I didn't have a sweet potato, and now I'm going to dice it into one half inch pieces. Now we have everything ready to go, and we can start cooking. The first thing I'll do is add a tablespoon of olive oil to a hot skillet. Swirl it around here. Then I'm going to add the uh, chicken and layer it in one layer and just let it brown for a minute or two on this side. After two minutes, I'm going to flip this single layer over and let it continue cooking until all the pink is gone.
Okay, next I'm going to take the chicken out and keep it warm. We want to leave a little bit of the uh, chicken juice in the pan and add a little uh, olive oil to that. Next, we put in the uh, onion, garlic, and red bell pepper. Here's the onion and garlic. and the red bell pepper. Cook until soft, about five minutes. Next, I add the sweet potato, some of the crushed red pepper, just a sprinkle, and some chicken broth, about a half a cup. Then cover with a lid and allow to cook for 8 to 10 minutes until soft. Okay, the next step is to put the chicken back into the pot. Give it a stir. of the kale. There's one and two. And stir that until it wilts. To serve, spoon out an appropriate serving for your guest. And then we're going to top it with Monterey Jack cheese. And it'll be melted by the time you get to the table. Give everybody some kale. Okay? Now we top it with the Monterey Jack cheese. It's pretty hot so it'll melt pretty quickly. Okay. Dinner is ready. Bon appetit.